Welcome back to another video on the channel, everybody, at JK Gaming. Today I'm going to be showing you the Millennium Falcon, which I built in Minecraft. And so I'm going to let you see a speed up version of me building it, and then you will get to see a final product. Alright, so this is just a sneak peek of the inside right here. This is the cockpit where Han Solo and Chewbacca would be flying the Millennium Falcon, and that's a little peek of the inside right there. But right now, I am just building like the landing platform, I guess you could say. I have the netherite beacons in the corners, and I have the, the sea lanterns, I think they're called, on the sides. And I did black concrete or dark gray concrete for the whole base of it, and I used right just gray concrete for um, the Millennium Falcon itself. <laughs> Actually, the Millennium Falcon's light gray concrete, and this is gray concrete right here. I think it looks really good with the sea lanterns. Just the color contrast and the lighting of it. I think it turned out really nice. And, yeah, so you can see me just building. And here is the final product of the Millennium Falcon. You can see a nice view from above right there. I just had the fireworks to get around faster, but here it is right there, the top of it. Um, right in the back, those sea lanterns are supposed to be like the boosters and stuff. You can see the beacons on the sides to make it so the Millennium Falcon knows where to land. And I have all those details on top, like the, the daylight sensors are supposed to just add extra detail. I based this whole build off of a Lego set that I have actually. Tried to make it look as close as I could to that. Here's the guns right here. The main guns would be on the top of the Millennium Falcon and that's it right there. I used grindstones for the ends of the gun to make it look good. And I used um I used stone brick steps right there to make a satellite. Looks pretty close to a satellite, about as close as you can get in Minecraft. And then I did all these pressure plates randomly to add extra detail. And here, from the top, you can tell how round it actually looks. It looks pretty close to the Millennium Falcon. And I think I end up actually expanding the like wing parts of the Millennium Falcon. But those 
yeah, those cows right there, I have them all in there so that nothing else would spawn around it. So that there's no mob spawning around it, and I have it in peaceful so that mobs, mobs don't spawn at night. And here is the inside. So you have just like your middle area with a lot of paintings around it. Then you have like your control area where people would like pilot it. There's a lot of paintings throughout. I have a little kitchen right there with like a brewing stand and a sink and all that. And there's a trash can right there. And he, uh, right here is the bedroom with three nice paintings in there. And I do not know why. Um, anyways, here's the control room. I think it looks really nice. I used a lot of stuff that makes it look like it has a lot of detail, like levers and these mob spawners and the redstone to make it look like wires on the ground and the beacon and the brewing stand and that lever and all that. Then I'm about to switch this block under the lever to re regular gray, not light gray, so it matches. And then you got your... Yeah, you got that, and then... Those areas with the doors right there would just be like where you'd enter if you're um, if you're going to board the Millennium Falcon, you'd enter right there, and then also right there Chewbacca's crossbow. You can't have the Millennium Falcon without his weapon inside, so I think that is a nice little touch to it. But even though the inside is not super detailed, I think it still looks pretty good. And then the outside is the main focus of the build. It just looks, I think it came really nicely together with all those pressure plates and everything to make it not look like it was just one solid thing. And yeah, so I think it just turned out looking a lot better than I had expected it to be. It was kind of hard to build the shape of it considering everything's blocks. And then there'd be like an under turret right there that'd be like the turret you shoot like is your secondary gun and then oops messed up that spot when I was trying to fix it but yeah I think it looks pretty good I have the spawners up top in the middle there I have some seats right there and then you already saw the cockpit earlier and yeah so that is my minecraft build let me know down in the comments what you'd like me to build next and I will see you next time on JK Gaming